Are you tired of spending a lot of money and getting absolutely nothing you wanted? Head on over to MrMuttCoin.com for the cheapest, safest, most reliable coins on the net. And are you also looking for training points to power up that player to make him just a little bit better? Training is also available on the website. Link is down below in the description. What up, my ladies and gentlemen? It's your boy, just welcome back to another Madden 19 video. Hopefully, you guys are doing fantastic. So, we're gonna go on ahead and uh, you know, we're gonna do some post commentaries for a little bit until you know, we figure the live commentary edit stuff out again. It shouldn't take too long. I appreciate you guys for being patient. I will say this though, I have been playing quite a bit of Madden lately, quite a bit of Madden. And I've been playing really bad. I haven't, you know, really been, you know, I put a team together. I'm trying different things out and I just play games, right? So if I beat you the past couple days, uh, you're not going to see it. If you beat the hell out of me the last couple days, you're not going to see it. I haven't really been recording. i just been wanting to play just to play. And I've been doing really, really, really bad lately. Like really bad. Like I got demoted from all Madden first string to all Madden second. Like that's how bad I've just been struggling lately. Um, which is some BS because I was three and three, right? This guy, he had three, <laughs> he had three um, false starts in a row, and on the third one, it said, you know, the connection to your peer has been, or kicked for a consensive reason. I never hit the A button to hit continue. I literally hit the middle button and went straight to MK, and when I came back, the game was a loss. So, it is what it is. But still, I shouldn't have been in that position anyway. I've been struggling badly, like really, really, really bad. I, I don't know what it is. I just know that uh, my offense has been lackluster. My defense has just... My problem is I'm, I'm running way too much 5-2. And I know I need to stay in nickel over G, right? I know this. I know I need to give myself the best opportunity to win. And nickel over G is going to get that, right? You got the cross man. You got the shed defense. You know, I'm able to send three. Keep, you know, Mac on a spy with great speed. So you're not going to be able to scramble on me. And that right there gives me the best opportunity to win. I know this. But I'm having way too much fun with 5-2. When it actually works, um, it's just it just hasn't been really working as much as I would like it to. Okay, now it makes sense. Now it makes sense. Something is going on with my settings. I'm receiving the ball first all the time, and now it literally makes sense. Where I go all, and and I go to my settings as I'm doing this commentary right here. I have defensive auto strafe off as it should be. Defensive ball hawk on right. Defensive heat seeker assist off. Defensive switch assist off those need to be on and then I have received first option instead of kick like I'm content I really think someone is signing on my account and messing with me and doing that on purpose and just leaving like now It makes sense why I'm always getting ball first on why whenever I switch I'm nowhere near in position and why I'm going on ahead and I'm not able to get any type of Heat-seeking suction tackles now it makes sense because all of it was off but anyway, second and goal right here, whoop, we end up hitting him with the spin move, and we end up scoring going up 7-2-0. So, as I've said, you know, I've just been really, really, really struggling lately, and it's just been ugly. Like, like look at that, I hit the A button to kick the, the PAT, and it just doesn't register. Like, nothing is going right for me. Like, I'm just really, 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 really doing bad in these Madden streets, man, and it's... It's frustrating. And this guy comes out in the same formation I run, which is I, weak, double. I, I don't know the name of the formation, man. But he comes out in that same formation every single play. He's got Tom Brady. I'm like, okay, I don't have to spy, right? We don't have to worry about that. He's going to be contained inside the pocket. You know, we're running 5-2. Uh, we got the double loop. And right there, it's like, that should be an interception. That right there, like, there's no way, like, I don't at least jump up. To at least go for it. This is what I think this this game is very frustrating. And they need to change several things. Like, if I hold the jump button, even if I'm not in position, I should at least jump. Imagine playing a game of 2K and they don't allow you to pump fake or shoot the ball because you're just too far. Like, it doesn't matter if I'm out of position. If I'm holding jump, I need to jump. I don't care. I'd much rather jump and have the ball go completely over my head than me get stuck and a tackle animation when I know I'm close enough to get the damn pick. So unfortunately, because we missed the PAT, we're down one point. And on, on uh, offense, you know, I feel confident. You know, um, he's not running any type of defense or anything that's going to give me too much trouble. Um, you know, no type of blitzes or anything like that. I believe he's just in shed defense. And, you know, we should do okay against that. You know, as long as we run the ball successfully, you know, do well. And when we pass the ball, make smart reads, we, we should be okay. So first and 10 right here. And uh, we have to get rid of the ball quickly. And... We just dropped the pass. I know someone was there, but it's like, come on. We just, we just flat out dropped the pass with no one around. Right here, 
I don't know what happened, but I I'll take it. Sometimes Walter's sweetness just gets sweetness right there. We get stuffed up the middle, so I'm like, you know, we're going to go for it. We're going to toss to the right side after a no huddle. And me, instead of going all the way to the outside, I just cut a field for no apparent reason, and we end up failing. Ah, oh, man. He goes deep over the middle. And again, I'm holding ball. I I'd rather me go for a pick, completely fall on the ground, nowhere near it, than me not get the animation when I'm hitting the button. Like, come on, come on. But we got an opportunity here. We can hold him to three here. I thought that was going to be a touchdown for sure, but thankfully he ends up dropping a third and goal. He's just going to go ahead and play it safe, take his three points. We're going to call a timeout and hope by some miracle we can get at least field goal range. And it's frustrating, the fact that instead of being only, you know, down three, which I should be, we're down four, because when I hit the eight button, it just didn't register. So you, you, you got to love that, right? <laughs> but without, um, you know, without trying to get too frustrated at myself, you know, uh, we can come back in this game. Again, he's not doing too much of anything. I just need to, you know, uh, play good, solid defense and, and, you know, get some better offense going. You know, we're definitely struggling on both sides of the ball now. And it's, it's extremely, extremely frustrating on how poorly I've been playing. Like, it's really, really, really bad. And um, I, I don't know what's going on. Like, uh, ever since the patch happened, I've been fumbling a lot lately. I've just been playing very poorly. I've been losing games that I know I shouldn't be losing. And, it, it, like, something's got to get, right? Because we're, we're just struggling way too much in these Madden streets. And, 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 and I feel like I'm too good of a player to be struggling. Of course I'm going to lose. I'm going to play people that are better than me or have fluke go their way. Because I beat people that I'm better than, that they're better than me. But I have fluke go my way, right? We get lucky. We get a few lucky breaks. And, you know, it is what it is. Um, but to flat out lose the people I feel like I'm better than because I just played so poorly, nothing's going my way, and to have it, you know, end up having having it happen to me so consistently, it's, it's frustrating to say not, to, to say the least, you know. But you know, we're down four, and uh, we got to get Dolphins going, man. We're struggling and, and, and we're struggling bad. Step up in the pocket right here. We got X, and we end up trying to reroute him to the left. But I don't get the reroute. X is always my reroute. See, that's another little things like that that happen. Like, X is always the reroute on that play. How was X not my playmaker right there? He's, oh, I've done this same route combination thousands of times. I know where I should have my playmakers. Unfortunately, he just wasn't. And uh, we decided to go for it. B is completely wide open. He had hard flats, and I just, I just missed it. And, see, that's the type of poor play I'm talking about. Now, we all know I have blind reads anyway. But it's like, that was so wide open. So wide open. I literally never even looked at it. He's 9 for 10. He's just dotting me up. There's just nothing I can do to stop this. Like, sheesh, man. The first game I'm uploading in a while, I'm going to go ahead and just get the bejesus beaten out of me. I'm just not good. But thankfully, LT comes away with a big sack. Knocks him out of field goal range. He's going to go for it. He chucks it up over towards um, Paul Krause. We click on. We get the pick. I don't know how. He, I mean, uh, Ball Hawk was all. No, Ball Hawk was on. That was the only thing that was on. But, um... Now, see, this is what should have happened. Reroute right there. You see how that reroute right there happened, that playmaker? That's what should have happened last time. I did the exact same route combination before. <sighs> Anyways. Anyways. It doesn't even matter. <laughs> uh, we need to go on ahead and run the ball. As you guys know, I run the ball a lot. And I need to run the ball effectively for my offense to be effective. Because if you just make me one dimensional and you force me to pass, I'm going to be in for a long day because I, I can't pass. It is what it is. I'm just not an effective passer when I need to be. I'm an effective passer if you have to worry about the run and then I'm just mixing in things here and there and then I have some things go my way um, because you're so keyed in on the run that you have to pay uh, extra attention to the run. You start making different adjustments. You get out of your blitzes. You get out of the defense that you're normally accustomed to just to stop the run and then I'll sprinkle in some passes here and there. But if I if I can't run and you know I'm a pass, I know I'm a pass, it's going to be a long day for me. It is what it is. I, my, my reads are bumps. <laughs> But, you know, we settle for three, but Lawrence Taylor says we're going to put the whole squadron on my back and we're going to come through and make plays for you now. So I'm like, you know, that's all I need. That's all right there. We get lucky in route. He just dropped the pass and maybe do the footsteps. I, I, I don't know, but I, I'll take it. Plenty of time in the pocket or so he thought. So Lawrence Taylor comes around and says, hello, remember me? 
and he makes his presence felt once again. So we end up holding him to a punt once again, and it's like, all right, all we need is three. That's all we need. We don't need nothing spectacular here. I haven't put a touchdown on the board whatsoever. My offense is looking dookie. It's looking buns. It's looking boo-boo, but all we need is three. There's no need to do anything extra. There's no need to try and score. Just get three. Get in field goal range, and we'll take it from there. So right here, no spy by him. Rookie mistake. Then we're going to go on ahead and take off Mimi with Michael Jeremiah Bartholomew on third from Dogs Vic. And we end up getting the first down really quickly underneath right there. Look at the spin move right there. The juke to the outside spin. Sweetness is so good, y'all. So second and four, we end up going to a draw. And he had the user shed. And I'm like, you got to be kidding me. You got to be kidding me. So we went back to the draw. The outside uh, blocking was absolutely fantabulous. And we easily pick up the first down. So he's going to go on ahead and hold on to his timeout, which is the smart thing to do. And he doesn't call another timeout right here, which I can see why. Because if I pick up the first down, you know. So uh, we get stopped shy. I'm on conservative, by the way. Calls timeout. We're going to run the ball on conservative. No, actually, no. I went blocking aggressive and running aggressive on that one. I went all in. Chips to the middle of the table. And I said, oh, I'm all in. So we end up uh, being held to three. But we are up two points. And I should be up three, but we missed a PAT. But it is what it is. Nothing I can do here, right? So now we need to trust our defense to make plays. And I feel confident. Again, he's not showing me too much where I feel like I should be worried. So I feel like we should be okay. And we also snuck the pass rush on aggressive. So, I, well, right here on second down, I remember it vividly. I feel like, you know, we should get a very good pass rush. And that's exactly what happens. Kevin Green and LT come around the outside. We're still on aggressive. He goes right up the seams right there. And he catches it. And I'm like, wait a minute. How is that open? Like, what? What's going on here? So first and 10, Tom Brady backs up, goes over there to the corner. But thankfully, it is incomplete. So no timeouts remaining. We blitz heavily. I, I blitz everyone. I'm hoping not to give him any time. And he chucks it up. And we come away with the bad pass. Fourth down, well, last down, last play of the game. I come up, same defense. I send the house. I send everyone. And we end up getting the sack. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, man. We're struggling. We're struggling badly. But a victory is a victory, right? <laughs> Until next time, it's your boy Jess. We're going to go ahead and be signing out. Peace! We're going to look at the defense. You see my man LT with four sacks or five. I don't know. He was all over the place.